this is Stampy and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am playing a race map. This is a uh, map which is called Nian Lights. And if I hop over here to the side, a uh, one sign's missing. I think that sign used to say play on creative. Uh, I think someone destroyed it because we're actually uh, playing on survival. Uh, but yeah, use swiftness. Uh, if you fail, fly back up. Uh, that is obviously not going to happen and have fun. Uh, yeah, this is a, a race map that was built by Ice Spanners and uh, Metricate. Uh, so a shout out to them down there. There will of course be links to their channels in the description. And I am playing against Super Chatch 39 And I am also playing, you might have seen them, uh, against uh, Ballistic Squid. Uh, as well as Choo Choo's Gaming. Oh no, the end portal didn't work. There we go. <laughs> so yeah, this is a, a race map that was uh, built in the end. And it's of course based around Nian Cap, uh, who you saw in the spawn there. And it's basically a whole load of blocks leading down here into a big circle. And uh, so what the, uh, the challenge is going to be is the first person to complete one lap of the circuit, which sounds... Sounds easy, but you can see some more of it loading in there. Yeah, this is a, a pretty long and uh, not difficult racetrack, but because you're doing so many drops in a row and trying to be quick, uh, it might actually uh, be pretty difficult. So it's going to be the first person to complete a lap uh, is going to go over here and uh, pull down the uh, the light to light up their name. And so we're going to be able to see who's first, uh, second, uh, third and fourth. And I'm a little bit worried uh, because uh, all of my opponents are very good at parkour and I am famously very bad <laughs> at parkour. Uh, so I'm not holding down uh, much hope for me winning, uh, but I am holding down quite a lot of hope of me having a lot of fun and a, a few laughs drawing the way. We've also got like a, an extra kind of little mini challenge uh, of trying to um, see for how long we can commentate uh, as if we were some horse race commentators. If you've ever seen the horse racing, uh, they speak very fast and frantically. And uh, so for the beginning, probably not for too long, uh, I'm going to see how long I can speak like a, like a horse race commentator and uh, everyone else is going to do the same. I've also got a bit of a tactic as well because we've all got swiftness potions. Uh, if I try, actually what I could do, yeah, if I splash myself and then grab another one, uh, then that way I can, I can have like a, another one uh, pretty uh, pretty soon as well. Uh, so all we're going to do uh, is wait here and then when everyone's ready, uh, Chatch is going to pull that lever and it's going to send a little trail of redstone to that light and then when the light uh, lights up, uh, that's going to be game on. So I guess I should try and get near the inside. To be honest, I don't think it matters about getting on the inside of the track. I think we're all going to fall off a hundred times and then end up giving up. And oh, he's pressed it. He's pressed it. Three, two, one, go, 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 go. And we're... <laughs> Right, respawn. Oh, come on, respawn. Back in. I wasn't the only one. Chat has gone down already. I think I was a little bit too eager at the start. Right, let's do this again, shall we? Right, let's get two swiftness then. Let's splash one now and uh, keep some on me. And let's go, right, horse, horse, um, horse uh, commentator and everybody off. And it looks like Choo Choo has gone for an early lead. Ballistic Squid has just fallen off. Chach and Stampy Long Nose are completely level, jumping over the color blocks. It looks like Choo Choo is a good 100 or so blocks ahead of the other two competitors. And oh no, looks like Stampy Long Nose has gone and fallen down and he is going to be leaving the end. Ballistic Squid would have respawned recently and he's going to be entering back into the end and getting back into the fray. It looks like Choo Choo is certainly the uh, the winner's choice. If you are a gambling man, I'd certainly back all of your money on the uh, luck of the, uh, the Irish there and going with Choo Choo, but the underdog uh, Stampy Long Nose uh, is showing quite a lot of potential as he does go and stock up uh, with a whole load more swiftness potions and sets out once again going across the track, but it looks like he actually managed to miss the swiftness potion. I didn't even know that was possible, but I think he's decided uh, to go anyway, and it looks like Chach has fallen off again. Little luck for Chach here in this race as Stampy uh, is finally making a small amount of progress, but it's not the time to start celebrating because he certainly wants uh, to try and catch up on some of the opponents. It looks like slow and steady. Uh, might surely be the way to, to win this race. And he's about to go to the first hoop. Can he make it over through the hoop? And he's managed to do it. He's through the big first colourful ring and now getting to the, the next section. He is starting his first ascent. Certainly uh, more difficult to do than jumping down. And he is certainly uh, deciding to take his time. Choo Choo is the only competitor in this race yet to fall out of the end and certainly uh, seeming to, to be the favourite. And I think I'm done. <laughs> I think that's the longest I can comment like that. And oh no, Chuch has fallen off again. <laughs> At least there's one person doing slightly worse than me. I'm doing quite good here, actually. Even though I think Choo Choo is way ahead. There we go. He just I was just going to say, even though he's way ahead, if he falls off, that's him way back to the start, just like the way we were. So if I, I think I actually might be in the lead here. I'm not sure where Squid is. Is Squid coming up behind me? I can't see anyone near me. I think, yeah, I think that... Oh, no, there's Squid there. Squid is ahead of me as well, actually. He's managed to get ahead of me. He seems to be my main competition. And that big ring, you see the ring he just went through. Oh, there we go. He just fell off. I was just about to say, that bit is actually really difficult. And so if I just go really steady and just make 
make sure I don't fall off. I could actually win this. Imagine that. Imagine if Stampy Cat ended up being the victor in a parkour race. <laughs> oh, did that? That would get headline news, that would, if I managed to win a parkour race. This is the difficult, though. Look at this jump here. Look at the size of that jump. I've only got little legs. Look at me. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to splash myself. I'm going to take my tie, and I'm going to try and get a big run up to make sure I don't muck this up. Go, 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 and jump. No! I didn't jump. <laughs> I think because I had swiftness, I just ran completely off the edge. Ah, oh, that was my chance. I think that was probably going to be my one and only chance of actually winning this race. If I made that jump, I think that's the uh, the halfway point. And then I think the uh, the second half is actually maybe even a little bit easier than the, the first half. And oh look, loads of people just fell off now. The problem is, once you've fallen off once, you try and go really quickly to make up time. And that's when you're more likely to make more mistakes. Let's go for little double hops, little double bunny hops, little, little boing boing. So I jump and then jump then steady up, jump, jump, steady up, because you can normally do a few jumps like this quickly, but you're gradually getting further forward, and so eventually you're just going to jump over the next block, and there we go, look, everyone's falling off, Squid's just gone, Choo Choo's just gone, they both did so well at the start, but now they're all panicking, and look at that, managed to get some speed there, Chat is just dancing, I don't think he cares at all about winning, I just don't think he wants to fall off again, let's see if I can overtake him, this is dangerous actually, because I'm here banging into him, I don't really want to do that, All right, let's just hope that he falls off, actually here's my chance to overtake him, if I go like this, there we go. I've managed to overtake Chat. Oh, look at that little burst of speed there. Check it out. I'm doing quite well here. I've managed to take the lead yet again. I know that uh, Squid and Choo Choo are going to be way behind me, but they're, they are probably definitely the favourites. They are uh, both known for being quite good at parkour when I'm known for being quite terrible at parkour. <laughs> uh, and Choo Choo didn't, uh, and sorry, Chat didn't uh, have much confidence before the game either. And oh, it's a bit of a a few awkward jumps here. If I go up this way, then up round this way, then up this way. Oh, I don't like this bit. I don't like it when it all seems a bit more random. When it's big straight lines like this, you kind of get into a bit of a river. And look how far ahead of Chat Chat managed. If he was able just to keep going, he might have won that. I think he's taken my tactic. He's gone for the, the tortoise tactic of slow and steady uh, wins the race. I think that he's going to do that the, the whole way through. And I'm approaching my nemesis. I'm approaching that big ring again. And this is going to be, uh, yeah, if I am going to fall off, this is probably going to be the time to do it. Right, I've used my next swiftness. Big run. Don't forget to jump this time and jump. And there we go. I managed to make it onto the ring. And if I hop up here a bit and then jump again. Oh no, there's a few more difficult ones. Oh, that bit's so tough. I did it though. That bit was really tough. And I've got swiftness now, which should make this bit hopefully uh, a little bit easier. I never like swiftness too much on this because I think that you've got a good chance of just running straight off the block. But I think if I use it on this bit going up, it's actually probably helping me a little bit. And I'm actually doing really good now. I'm actually getting a little bit nervous. My hands are getting a, a little bit shaky on the controller. And look at the screen. Everyone just fell off, I think, pretty much there. Did Squid go? I think Chutu and Chut certainly fell. I think they're falling off on purpose to try and cover the screen. There was just text covering my screen then of people falling off the end and entering the end and all sorts. It made it really hard to see. I'm doing so well though. I've actually got a chance of winning this. I'm actually really nervous. All I need to do is not muck up. If I just keep my composure and keep doing my little bunny hops and oh no, there's Chuch gone again. Oh, he was doing so well with his slow and steady tactic. What's that? And that's Choo Choo's fallen off as well. Right, Ballistic Squid I don't... No! well, didn't you? You saw that. I did so good. Uh, okay, no one's won yet. No one's won. So I've still got a chance. That is so depressing though. That is so demoralizing after doing so well. Right, let's go. Right, race is back on then. Seeing as I've already fallen, I might as well go for a little burst of speed. And look at Choo Choo go. Oh, he's going diagonal to try and get some speed. All right, Choo Choo, don't, don't taunt me. Right, here we go. I managed to overtake him. This might be, this might be the one. I feel more confident now because I managed to do so well then. Oh, look at me go. Look at me doing really well. I kind of see why Choo Choo keeps falling off now. If he's trying to go this fast, I can kind of understand it. I know I thought Chuch was trying to cheat then. Can I just drop down, down to there and just carry on going? <laughs> I'm not going to cheat. I don't think we're allowed to use any any sneaky shortcuts, but there we go. Oh no, look! I can see Ballistic Squid underneath me. He's just managed to get to the speed up bit, the, um, the, the big ring that I struggled with. Right. 
Watch the bottom left hand corner of your screen and let's see if Ballistic Squid's about to fall out of the world. There's a good chance it's going to happen. If it is going to happen, now is probably the time it's going to be. But to be honest, he's so far ahead, the chances of me catching him are slim to none. And so I just really, really need to hope that Squid's going to fall off. And there we go! Squid has gone. I called it. I knew he was going to go. That's good though. That means that I've got a really good chance. Choo Choo is kind of steaming ahead. Uh, but as long as he falls off at that bit, I've got a chance. Right, I'm going to have to try and catch him. There's no point playing cautious anymore I'm only a little bit behind him so if I'm able to catch him up here this might be the uh, the photo finish we've been after and is he waiting for me is he standing there waiting for me to get to him what a gentleman what a gentleman and oh I nearly fell off then I ran out of sprint then what's he doing is he trying is he just building himself up to it right well if you're not gonna go then choo choo I'm gonna show you how it's done I've done this once before and jump and there we go I made it to the halfway point Let's see Choo Choo go, and Choo Choo's done it as well. Is he just going to go straight across if I jump from here? And then go like this, and this. There we go. I've made it across. And why, why am I waiting for him? This is a race. We're competitors. Imagine seeing the Olympics, and you see, like, Usain Bolt charging ahead. And he gets to the end, and then just decides to stay there and wait for the other competitors to go and catch up. And look at this. Look at me speeding my way along now. Right? I want to be careful now. I'm in the lead. I've got a pretty good lead, but... I had a lead earlier, and then I fell off the map. So let's not have a repeat of that, shall we? Little baby hops. Hop again. Hop again. The problem is, earlier, I was miles out ahead by myself, and there was no real competition. Now, Choo Choo is right up with me. And so I can't just go slow and steady. Because he's so close behind me, if I go slow, he can just go and overtake me, which would be... Yeah, I think I'd, I think you'd hear me howling like a wolf and crying yet again. Is this it? This is the final bit. These are the final few blocks. If I make this, I can win. Right, where's Choo Choo? Is he anywhere near me? I think he's fallen off. Right, I can take my time on these. Steady, steady. Steady. Ch chat, chat, watch me. Chat. Oh, he's not looking. Chat, I've done it. I have won. I managed to do it. <laughs> I managed to get to the end. Oh, I wish Chuch could see my glorious moment. You all saw it, didn't you? You all saw it. How is everyone else doing? Like, Chuch is setting off down the, the big colourful road once again. I think I think that's Choo Choo all the way over there. I don't know if he fell off, I guess. And look, there's Squid as well. Squid seems to be pretty close. I think this is here Squid making his way up that fast bit there. Oh, he's getting some good speed. He's trying to be careful. The problem is they all have no idea that I have won. Because they can't see me, they have no idea what's going on. What I think I might do is I might hang around for, for Squid and try and, and try and cheer him on, seeing as he is my, my buddy and hopefully he can win. Well, they're all my friends, but, you know, me me and Squid have got that, that special relationship. And he's doing really well. Look at him. He's, he's trying to trying to catch me up. If he didn't know that I have won, he would have had a, a good chance of catching me up. And he's on his, he's on his final few jobs. Oh, no. And Choo Choo's just seen. Choo Choo's just seen that my, my light has lit up. <laughs> you did well, though. Don't give up. You can still get second place. It doesn't mean game over. And here comes Squid. His final few jumps. He must be so nervous right now doing that. And he has done it. So Squid came second then out of the, uh, the race, I guess. And I realize I never actually finished the finish line. So to make it official, I might as well cross that. So I came first. And uh, Squid came second. As seen as Choo Choo has just fallen off again. It might take a, a while to see what place they came. But I'm going to have a, a message coming up on the screen. Uh, telling you who came in uh, who came in third and who came in fourth. But there we go. You all witnessed Stampy Cat winning a parkour race. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. There'll be a link in the description to the download of the map. As well as the, uh, the builders channels. Uh, as well as uh, all of my other opponents. Uh, there'll be a link uh, to them as well. And I didn't take the sign. I think I think Squid was writing a sign and Choo Choo might have stole it. Anyway, that's the end of this video here. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later. Bye!